Hi. During a night of a lot of tequila and bad decisions, I started wondering if anyone has ever tried speedrunning all of the Age of Empires 2 campaigns. And to my surprise, yes, there are a few attempts. But most of the ones I found are not updated to the new DLCs, and some of them are from before the HD version even came out. So I decided to give it a shot. But unlike most speedruns you find in the wild, I made my own rules for it. The timer in the end screen is the one that counts, because I don't know how to add the fancy green counter. I don't have to do all the campaigns in a row. Let's be honest, there's 34 campaigns with multiple missions and I have a life. Sort of. The difficulty is set to standard. Because even though I've been playing the game since 2000, I'm still not great at it. I'm not allowed to pause and continue later. And once I finish a mission, there's no retrying. If I want a better time, I have to redo the entire campaign. I'll also try to complete them in order of release, starting from the Age of Kings campaigns all the way to the India Dynasties DLCs. But that's a secondary objective, since I know some are incredibly dull and I will lose interest. Walking Simulator is the first mission, but I find solace on the fact that the narrator has a Scottish accent and I get to beat up the British. The chef's kiss of the whole campaign. Time is 3 minutes and 20 seconds, and I don't think it would have been much better even if the soldier didn't run away. Straight into feeding the army, what should have been the fastest time in the whole campaign gets ruined because I can't decide which tree to cut. And forgot where the gold is. Also, has this big ass rock always been there? 446 is the final time. No time wasted here, straight to houses and a barracks, and the four militia are out and ready to bash Brit skulls in 2 minutes and 37 seconds. Resource and technology just requires feudal age, men at arms, and fighting some crooked thief assholes. The scenario gives us most of the resources needed for it, just gotta get some food to make sure there's no idle time towards the objective. No hiccups here and the timer ends at 4 minutes and 59 seconds. Here the game starts giving us an actual challenge to go through. A base must be set, a military trained and the British forces annihilated. They do attack first and I'm never ready for it. A lot of time wasted here. Got to feel the age and got attacked again, and it would be nice if the tower they told me to build actually helped. Army ready and time to steamroll the tower and take back the three houses for Scotland in 19 minutes and 33 seconds. This scenario requires three relics to be gathered inside the monastery. One is in Yellow's base and the other behind British walls. I don't know how to speed this one up, and even though my time is a hot pile of garbage, it might still be the best I've had in 20 years playing this game. I also wasted time trying to save Yellow after taking the relic, which makes no sense after doing so. Also, why did the game ask me to give Yellow food and gold just for them to tribute me back to resources? Excuse me, Mr. Villager, would you like some haggis? I didn't have to destroy the whole town, but it felt right. Don't judge me. All relics captured in 22 minutes and 52 seconds. And finally, the Battle of Falkirk, the final mission of the William Wallace campaign, where we need to build a castle and destroy the British castle. Starting off terribly, I waste stone closing off walls and building towers in the wrong places. We fend off the British aggression with relative ease and build the castle. I probably didn't need to make any rams as the AI usually opens the gates for us and let everyone in. Speaking of rams, where do you think you're going? Wallace comes for our aid, not that I need him after 7 missions. Castle falls without a problem, and Falkirk is ours in 19 minutes and 36 seconds. Total runtime, 1 hour, 16 minutes and 43 seconds. Absolutely horrifying time. The current world record is 13 minutes and 14 seconds. Which, first of all, how? Just the 4 missions seem impossible to do under 10 minutes total. Hopefully the following campaigns can help me lower the difference between my time and the top one spot, which is no one, because no one is messed up in the head enough to try something like this. Next one is Joan of Arc.